folks getting closer to Christmas in fact let me see it'll be just a a week basically a week after this devotion actually less than a week well maybe a little more than a week I'm looking at my calendar anyway point is this uh, you know I realize that I'm pretty old-fashioned in some areas and not so much in others uh, I really am try not to be a control freak I, I heard somebody say recently there's only two types of people in the world and I think this tends to be true those that seek to control others and everything and those who just simply aren't as concerned about control I imagine you have to have some control in just about every area that you're involved in to some degree for one thing you gotta control yourself but I'm talking about people that just simply want to control others well I, I have very few areas that uh, I'm, I'm very concerned about control and one of them being my Christmas tree now it's it's an old-fashioned thing I like the smell of the tree I like to have a tree that stands tall I like to do it myself which meant I almost blew my back out this year because I did it myself um, I love putting on C7 blinker bulbs and I'm beginning to realize that I probably won't be able to do uh, a live tree much longer it's just probably physically not going to be especially if I'm going to get one that has a decent size to it so perhaps someone out there can help me with this little dilemma that I have I'm a c7 blinker bulb man now that's old-fashioned because it goes all the way back to my childhood it was just something I enjoyed get up in the middle of the night when everybody else was sleeping me and my brother and we kind of creep out into the the room after mom and dad had well, now I'm speaking to adults I hope put all the gifts under the tree so we would sneak out and we'd watch as we turned on the light of the tree and all those bulbs would be going off in all different times it did this incredible display on the wall as, as you watched each bulb just kind of at various times just blink it was it was magical it's just one of those it gives me a warm feeling just thinking about it I'm a c7 blinker bulb man I bought a case of them just so if they ever ran out I'd, I'd have them till when I die I'm gonna leave behind me a meal whole bunch of c7 blinker bulbs so if somebody could help me find an artificial tree that takes c7 blinker bulbs without those canned lights that would be a real blessing to me and since we're in the devotional phase here I'm gonna spiritualize this in many ways isn't the body of Christ like those c7 blinker bulbs now would anybody want the body of Christ to just boom 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 just you know no in the body of Christ you have all these individuals they're all unique they're bing 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 different colors different expressions different personalities different gifting it's not one personality it's it's the, the unique elements of all the various cells being brought together in the body of Christ with the Holy Spirit being the blood that flows through us that very spirit that animates us and there's a unique identity but there's unique distinctions too I'm totally spiritualizing my C7 blinker bulbs but in many ways that's what the body of Christ is like it's kind of boring to have something that just goes burn 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 who wants that I don't care if it changes from red to yellow, but they all change at the same time no I like diversity I like unique aspects I like the complexity of the body of Christ that you can't put your finger on but it's just amazing it's a miracle that's why in 1st Corinthians 12 and verse 
before and on through the end of the chapter. We're not all the same. And the Holy Spirit is the engineer behind it all, it says in verse 4 through 11. And then we're all uniquely apart in verse 27. It's pretty cool. It's what makes church unique, if it's truly a body. I don't want to just go to church. I want to go and be a part of the body of Christ. I want to be a C7 blinker bulb. doesn't matter what color. Just blue, green, yellow, red, white. I just want to blink. My own particular unique blink. Till next time, friends, God bless you.